With recent tragedies, racial tensions, and Black Lives Matter protests, doctor, doctors suggest now is a pretty good opportunity to talk to your kids about race. Amanda Quintana has more on how parents can start those conversations. Talking about racism can be uncomfortable. For a long time, it's been a taboo topic, especially for white people. But SSM health psychologist, Dr. Kathleen Hipke says, now is a good time to start this conversation with kids. Talking about what's a protest, what's racism, and why are people upset? She says, while some parents might think their kids are too young for such a negative topic, or it's too much to put on them, studies show kids are not colorblind. From infancy, really, children start to be able to differentiate those around them based on race and by preschool uh, they're very curious by kindergarten they're making some pretty clear decisions about playing with kids who look like them particularly the white children and so if we're not having conversations um, even at a very early age then basically what we're saying is we're going to kind of let the external environment shape um, children's beliefs she says parents don't have to worry about saying the perfect thing. What's important is learning together as a family, using books and TV shows, even like Sesame Street to start. Dr. Hipke says while many parents might try to shield kids from seeing rallies and police brutality on TV because it's hard to discuss, kids are intuitive. They'll pick up on the tension and emotion, and by talking, you can help children name those feelings instead of letting them try to figure it out on their own.